And they said, we don't have any paperwork. We are German Jews. And I can only assume, if, even though nobody's ever told me this, maybe you might know something about this, Anthony. They were probably tested for German. Mm -hmm. And all three of them, don't forget, that's all there were, my grandparents and my mother, they were tested for German, and they were believed to be Germans, and they were allowed to emigrate to the United States. <laughs> because if they had thought that they were from Romania, they never would have uh, been allowed. They would have been sent back to Romania. And uh, to this day, my mother does not know a word of Romanian or, the, or Ukrainian. Mm. It's a beautiful question. Mm. Carrie, you wanted to say th something about photographs? Oh, oh, thank you for so thank you, thank you for reminding. Uh, <clears throat> another project that I'm working on at the moment, and I was uh, is a online um, museum which has to do with the history of Romania. So I don't know actually if it will. 100% uh, you know, be, meet the requirements. Um, if there is anybody here that has any background and would be interested in supplying any photographs or stories, if there are any, maybe I should just ask if there are any. I have on my, my handout my email, and also, first of all, anybody at any time who would like to contact me, please feel free. You see my email at the bottom. You have my references, and that's my other article at the bottom. You can please click onto that at any time if you'd like to read my other article. <clears throat> the, there's an online museum for Romanian history that's being developed, and they requested anybody who'd be interested in supplying photographs to this online museum. You may be in touch with me, and I can further advise you if you'd like. And that's it. Thank you for reminding me of that. Okay, let's give her a call.